Hi, I'm Saskia, and I'll be talking about more advanced functionality in REDCap, which could help you when collecting data for research purposes, such as clinical trials or longitudinal studies. In this video, I will show you how to add parameters to your data collection, such as limits on minimum and maximum values and specific date formats on REDCap. Data quality is something that can be improved from the way your REDCap project is built. Numbers and dates can be recorded very differently depending on who is entering the data, or there can easily be data entry errors. Date fields can need a lot of data cleaning if the dates are collected in different formats, such as text fields or with different positions for the day, month, or year values. By adding parameters to your fields, you can reduce the need to check and clean these fields. This is useful if there is a set numerical range for your field, for example, that age cannot be less than zero, or you want to consistently collect dates in the same format, for example, as DDMMYYYY. To set upper and lower limits on numerical data or define a date format, go to the homepage of your project and click on the design icon on the left hand panel. Select the instrument you wish to edit. If your project is live, you will first have to enter draft mode by clicking on the Enter Draft Mode button in the yellow box at the top of your screen. Scroll down to select the field you wish to edit and click on the pencil icon in the top left of that field's box. A pop-up should now appear. On the right-hand side of the pop-up, underneath the variable name box, is a box called Validation. Use the drop-down menu to select the validation parameter and or format you would like to apply to your data. Once you have selected your valid format, minimum and maximum boxes should now appear. Fill them out with any specific parameters you need to apply to your data, such as a maximum date at the end of your project, or the minimum and maximum values for a dose of medication. Click Save. Click Add Edit Records on the left-hand pane to enter practice data to test your variable to make sure you have applied the correct validation to your data before committing the changes to your live project. To commit the changes, click the Submit Changes for Review button in the yellow box at the top of the Online Designer homepage. Your ResCap administrator will now review and commit the changes to your project. The same changes can be made by editing your data dictionary before uploading. Open your data dictionary and scroll down to the row of the variable you wish to edit. Add your selected parameter into the text validation type or show slider number column, usually column H. Add your minimum and maximum values into the text validation min and max columns, usually columns I and J. Save your data dictionary and upload it to REDCap. First, save your data dictionary as a CSV file in your local drive, and then upload it to REDCap through the data dictionary tab. Set your CSV file parameters, and then click Choose File. Navigate to and select your saved data dictionary, click Open, and then click Upload File. Please see the links to additional resources alongside this video in the description.